Following the release of 14 students of Greenfield University over the weekend, security experts have urged the government to take charge of the rising security challenges in the country and not leave the victims and their families to their fate. Plus TV Africa's Ungozika Oaichesi tells us more. After 40 days in the hands of their captors, the student reunites with family and friends. However, their parents have cried out over millions of naira, including motorcycles paid as ransom without support from the government. In their words, the government has failed them. 190 without government assisting us. Apart from the nation that we gave them, they push us to go and loan money. They push us to go and do what we don't expect. We sell our house. We sell our property that we have for our children to be released. We are not happy. Tell the government of Nigeria that we are not happy. It's 150 million. I will not hide the truth. Governments that say they want to protect us. The government that they we promise us they are going to protect our people. How can my wife go to go to work for two days and I'm paying about over five million with the torment? I can't hide the truth. Reacting to this development, some security experts in Abuja say the government should take responsibility for the security issues in the country and not show weakness. They are quick to demand adequate compensation for the parents of the abducted student because they've gone through a lot to provide the ransom, including untold trauma without the government's help. If the government is serious, if we, the government will sit up its responsibility, we expect them to bring this money back to the parents as the children are back and then deal with the situation decisively. I have been saying and I have been arguing, all the criminals that are operating in northern Nigeria, especially in the northwest, all these bandits are known. All these bandits, all their locations are known. So government should sit to its responsibility and take a decisive measure to deal with the situation. So if you are a government and you are not able to provide security and the people are, are kidnapped and you say you are not going to negotiate, what does that mean? Do you want them to be killed? So the parents who, who, have, who, who have to sell all they have to, to secure their children, they have, they have been shortchanged. They have been dealt a very deadly blow. So I, I, I really... I think, to me, the government must, must find a way to, to compensate them. Governor Nasiu El Rufai has assured the released students that the bitterness of the last few weeks is now over, as he will set the backdrop for positive achievements in their lives. For Plus TV Africa, Ngozika Ohai Chesi. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.